He's seven to one. Tina's pet at eight to one. Cajun at nines. Ten to one bar those four. And let's join Peter. Thank you, Jimmy. Yes, that's just about it. They're just about all installed. Oh, under right. starter's orders. And they're away. Fearless lad breaks fast towards the right of the picture over on the far side blue sing and croft hall very fast in the center my lover and it's my lover in the center clan jolly right up with them on the near side tina's pet being tracked by fearless lad they're coming down past the three furlong pole and it's my lover in the lead in the center from clan jolly steel charger running fast tina's pet right there under the stands rail with it probably the, in the, the advantage now probably Tina's pet in the lead on the stand side as they come down to the two furlong pole from steel charger right over on the far side croft hall with blue sing and cajun but it's Tina's pet and joe mercer in the lead from fearless lad trying to challenge now on the stand side with steel charger also and racing into the closing stages now and it's Tina's pet being pressed by fearless lad edward hyde coming there very strongly on the near side and fearless lad in fact coming to take it up now as they race towards the line fearless lad's gonna win it well and at the line, Fearless Lad wins in second. Is Chelliston Park third? Blue Sing and 14 as pets behind them. Came Jester and looking back to last, it was the early leader, my lover. And so the result of the Kingstown Stakes first number nine, Fearless Lad, owned by Mr. G. Soulsby and Mr. A. Soulsby, trained by Richard Peacock and written by Edward Hyde. And uh, for me, number 16, Chelliston Park is second though the judge has called upon a photo to determine second third and fourth places i think we'll find chelliston park for second blue sing third tina's pet four it's very near between blue sing and tina's pet for third and fourth but no doubt whatsoever that fearless lad by import who himself won the 1976 wokingham under nine stone four nine stone four has won the king stand very easily indeed they're getting a grateful Pat from Edward Hyde, who won this in 1976 on Loch Nagar. And this very useful horse that I've been watching attentively doing his work up here at Ascot over the last two or three days has won it just as his connections thought he would, just as his lad expected him to do. A white faced horse who reminds me, I'm bound to say, of an earlier winner in B Friendly, and this is probably one of the reasons that influenced me in favor of going for him in the Express.